if you have used Heroku, Versal or Railway, the idea is similar. But as we will see, Sevala has some unique strengths like unlimited collaborators and usage based pricing. So if you are working with a team, Sevala lets you to add unlimited users to your projects with no extra cost. And this is a big deal because platforms like Heroku or Versal often charge per team seat or have limits on collaborators and free tiers. With Sevala, you can invite all your teammates to view logs, edit environment variables, or help debug without hitting a paywall. Sevala doesn't make you pick a fixed server size plan upfront, and there are no tiers or plan limits. You pay only for what you actually use in terms of resources. And as we saw, Sevala provides managed database right out of the box. We could create a Postgre DB with a few clicks. We could just as easily add a Redis cache or an object storage bucket. Sevala's object storage is S3 compatible and unlimited. And finally, when you deploy in Sevala, your app runs on Google's Kubernetes engine. That is on Google Cloud infrastructure. This means your app can scale and perform like an enterprise-grade deployment by default.